Well, you just saw Christine Boggs in that top five challenge, but get this, she barely made it into the top 10. After a lot of hard work, she has fought her way into the finale and has dreams of becoming Toledo's next Biggest Loser. Christine Boggs has had quite a journey so far in Toledo's Biggest Loser. She stepped on the scales back in October, not really sure what to expect. I was very close to going on cholesterol medicine and I did not want that. So this gave me the chance to get off my couch and get healthy. Not only that, she wasn't sure she would ever be able to run again. 15 years ago, she was in a major car crash and crushed her ankle. After three surgeries and a plate and some screws, she is off and running again because of Toledo's Biggest Loser, pushing herself to do more than she ever thought she could, and it's paid off. Yeah, I'm down over 30 pounds, so pretty proud of that. She's lost 21 and a half inches on her waistline and is feeling better both physically and emotionally. Her husband's friends didn't even recognize her. She made it through each weigh-in, but was usually at the bottom of the pack. Did she have the dedication and willpower to make it into the top 10? Just barely, she slid into the very last spot and headed to the final weigh-in in May. She pushed herself really hard throughout April and was jumping for joy when she found out she made it into the top four. Her strategy to become Toledo's biggest loser? Well, keep working out. She says she doesn't want to go back to look like this ever again. Definitely doing a good work out there for her. Stay right there, everybody. We will meet the contestant that has been brought back from that loser's bracket right after this.